Russia has released a chilling video that shows a nuclear strike on the US state of Florida. So what does this mean exactly? I'll fill you in here on IO. What is good? This is Inform Overload, your YouTube source for trending news. I'm Charlotte Dobre. Well, it's been a little while since we freaked you guys out with a possible World War 3 scenario. North Korea has been pretty quiet lately, but it seems actually that North Korea is not who we should be worrying about, it's Russia. During a presidential address to Russian parliament, Vladimir Putin bragged about Russia's new nuclear capabilities, weapons that would render NATO defenses quote completely useless. He boasted about a nuclear powered cruise missile and while doing so, he used a visual aid which was basically an animated video that shows how Russia would blow up Florida, which is coincidentally Donald Trump's home away from home. The video displays multiple nuclear warheads firing through space before hitting the state of Florida. Putin claims that Russia has also developed weapons that don't use ballistic trajectory, meaning that any missile defenses against an enemy nation will be useless. There is actually this on Online competition where Vladimir Putin invited people to come up with a name for his new advanced nuclear weapons. Some of the suggestions include Kremlin's hand, Peace Envoy, ironic, she drowned, and wait for it. Goodbye America. There have been over 63,000 name suggestions just in the first 17 hours of the competition going live. It has been rumored for quite some time that Russia has been developing destabilized weapon systems, but I guess this speech confirms it. Developing these weapons is in direct violation of its treaty obligations, according to White House Press Secretary Sarah Sanders. In his speech, Putin was quoted saying, any use of nuclear weapons against Russia or its allies, any kind of attack, will be regarded as a nuclear attack against Russia. Russia, and in response, we will take action. And in response, we will take action instantaneously, no matter what the consequences are. His speech drew repeated applause. Putin is partially making these remarks because he is up for re election quite soon. Thanks to these threats from Russia, the Trump administration is working on a new missile defense policy. Before, the threats were just Iran and North Korea, but now the United States has to worry about Russia and China. Well, that's just great. American generals want to develop better sensors to track cruise missile threats. We will keep you updated on this story, but for now, that is all I have for you on this. To stay tuned, to stay informed, smash the like and subscribe to IO, and I'll see you in the next video.